Hello, I want to show you how to use MailChimp on smartphone to build your email list and to, to build your email list and to send emails and to create landing pages. Before this recent update, there was no uh, landing page on the mobile, it was only on the website. But now they've included creating landing pages in um in the mobile app, which is even better because landing pages helps with um, what we call customer onboarding or client onboarding. It helps with selecting your prospective clients. It helps you to uh, it helps your lead. It helps in generating lead. So, in emails, in building your email list. Before we get to that, let's just go through the basic interface of the MailChimp email marketing app. At this point, you're seeing the home page, we're showing you the subscribe contact, total contact, and subscribes, and average open rates in the last one week. So you'll see how your previous emails have been doing. So next is Explore. Explore shows is like a blog showing you information about recent news that you need to read to probably help you help you with your uh, digital marketing and email marketing as you can see it's covering different aspects So um next is the audience. And the audience will show you number of subscribe contacts and open rate and all and all and all and all and all. And you can easily add contact to add contact, you click this plus sign here, it shows you import from devices if you already have like emails in your phone they will be imported automatically or you can scan details by you can add a new contact by scanning or you can add manually which is like mostly what I do so you add manually by you just imp you impute the person's email address which is the most important thing and the first name on the last name and other con information that you would like to add like tags to make it easy when you're done with that you, are, you click this good sign now if the contact was already there before now it wouldn't it would tell you the email has been added to your email list so uh, the next thing is the campaign which is not the most important thing the campaign contains all your previously done emails and creating a new one to create a new one all you have to do is to click this plus sign here and before there was no landing page but now there's a landing page so um you can create an ad here you can create an email you can create a landing page but to create your email you click this create an email now you have so many options this is already like drag and drop. Everything that you need is already inside. Showcase your products. You want to share your big news. You want to share your story. You want to send a follow-up email. Or you want to help your users. Or you want to like, let's get started. So each of those have their own layout. Let me just choose one layout and explain how it works. So you select it. Go up here and click select. And... As you can see now, before now, in your settings, you have already put your logo in your settings. I will show you later. So, you title your campaign, you choose your audience. That's you already have a place uh, where you categorize your audience, and you already have an audience like a, a category. This is a free, a free MailChimp allows up to 2,000 contacts. 2000 emails so and it allows you to have only one folder one category 
the premium one that you can have as many categories as you want you can just channel contact that to which to the folder you want them to go to so so you select your audience you say you want to send to entire audience or to a group of group of contact or segment to a tag or to a specific contact whichever one that you want then you come back here um they not type your email subject you know that's like a title that they're going to see the preview text that will show like when they get the email then of course your logo the name you want them to see and the email address you want them to know is coming from so you choose that so now you don't click you click preview and edit now this is how the template looks like all you have to do is to edit these things here so in the first part now is a topic you choose a captivating topic that will make your clients want to click the email then you can add a photo when you click each part to edit it you, down here you will see move you can move any of these placeholders you can duplicate them or you can edit when you click edit see you can edit it you can make it bold italicize it underline it or you can add a link to it so um, when you are done you save and close so next is you can change the image you click all you have to do is click edit you can to replace the image that is already here you click here then you upload the file from you upload the file from your phone and upload it here then you select it and it appears it does not appear of course remember to edit the title the, the alt edit the link if, if you want the image to be clickable you add the link you add a link to it so the image can be clickable then if you want to optimize it you edit all all text that's the title that you wanted to have you edit all text so this is it so you can now edit the content what you want them to read about it then this button here you can edit it and put a link where you want the, want the button to take you want the button to take them to so when you do that the next thing is to just everything else here is drag and drop everything else here is drag and drop so you just click each placeholder and you just edit you just click so even down here these are social media links you can add a social media link by clicking here too you click edit and you just add your social media handle and then you can add up to 10 you can add up to 10 of social of links you want this place to lead to so that's that you can edit down here you know the year uh the name of your company and all this you can just you can edit here to have what you want just leave this one to change how you receive these emails just uh, change it so when you're done with this place just click that you're done when you click done it tells you to save and it exists then you click send so it's that simple because you should already have your your pictures your images and you should already have your content the, uh, you want you should already have your con the content that you want so all you have to do is just like you know, copy and paste or you type it out and then you send your emails and it goes straight to the contacts you've been collecting over time so this is basically how to do this now let's look at the uh, landing page it's a landing page so, so you put your logo 
and the next thing is you make a statement let me know what you're all about you keep it brief like be like okay um i have four secrets four secrets to making sales online you impute it you keep it brief then you be like okay buy now you buy now button you choose it then you add an image it's just balancing you know we talk about a landing page is a just something simple to help you collect contact like you know um, one of the rules of uh, sales funnels is that you don't send people to a website a website is too busy and clumsy that the, a typical client wouldn't know what to do when he gets to when he or she gets to a website so you're using a landing page just simply directing them so I'll talk about lead lead magnet and landing page and all that and collecting your emails so you add your image then you reach out so you be like okay keep follow me on Instagram follow me on this 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 is that 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 let us say like follow me on Facebook and stuff so this is simply basically a simple landing page this is it by now like us on Facebook and you submit you hold in the page title so you hold in and you publish it is that simple so a landing page helps you to you know help you to easily promote or collect data or collect information I bring the right people to your landing page. They it helps them to narrow, uh, narrow down their actions. So basically, on the on the on the laptop on the on the uh, desktop version of this landing page is it's 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 a much bigger stuff. It's like a website that is narrowed down to control the action of the clients. Like you see details categorized. This is broader than is broader than this. This is just a new addition to the app, and it helps you to collect emails, and it helps you to uh, narrow down your leads. So, what's a lead? A lead is a prospective client. What's a lead magnet? A lead magnet is something cheap or free that you use to magnet your lead into your funnel. So, how do you do this? You can you can collect emails. Um, from social media like your whatsapp your facebook your instagram your twitter you can collect emails there so i'll do whatsapp makes it very easy whatsapp makes it very easy to collect emails how do you do this first of all you create your lead magnet something free something that have this um uh, curiosity around it you can post on on your social media your Facebook or Twitter or Instagram that will make people curious enough to click your link to your WhatsApp when you, when you click your link to your WhatsApp you use what we call uh, you use what we call the label option this label option you use label when you use label you you when when the when when the client clicks your WhatsApp link, it could they come into your WhatsApp, and what they will meet is your automated message. Telling them, your automated away message, telling them, hey, glad that you have you here. I am such a super person, and this is it. Super, I have something to offer you, but I need to save my number and I can save yours. And to do this, please, what's your name, and email address. And make sure and ensure that I also save your name too. That way, you increase your your customer base, you increase your client base, number of persons that will be on your WhatsApp contact, fresh faces, new faces that you can sell to a market to. And when you drop your email address, you carry it immediately, and you come to your Mailchimp and you add it to your email address, your email. So what you do is you create a lead, a lead magnet, which can be in free or something very cheap. And you target traffic to it by through an ad because organically, organically, 
you can guarantee you can guarantee new leads through organic reach but you can guarantee new leads through paid ads so you can invest in invest a little in paid ad on facebook or instagram and you send um you make sure that the link that they are clicking is a link to your whatsapp and then the automated message greets them and they will leave their email address and they leave their name. You save their name and you're building your WhatsApp contact and you're building your email list at the same time. So over time, you collect emails through that way. So the first thing to do is you categorize your lead. What kind of people am I looking for now? Okay, I want to teach them this and so. What kind of people need what I'm teaching? So you go and put an ad around those people on Facebook or Instagram and you boost that post and when you boost it when you run the paid ad and they read your intriguing interesting content with the captivating photo they'll click the link and they come into your whatsapp funnel and they'll drop your name and email address you add the email address to your email list or your mail chain that way you build both your whatsapp contact and your email list so this is like a simple way to build your email list using whatsapp and also to create emails that you send to the, to the emails in your email list so just remember when you get those emails you just come here and come to your audience and you click this plus sign and you add manually you just keep on adding them adding them adding them adding them so you can always like market to them over and over and if you want to market to them all you have to do is to come to campaigns and you click this plus sign and you choose an email and select what you want to do and all just know all these things are drag and drop and you can play around with it and add whatever you want to add to it so it's very simple it's very simple the most important thing here is uh your lead your lead getting the right lead magnet the right content for your lead magnet and channeling traffic to your lead magnets and send, sending them to your whatsapp collecting your emails and adding them to your mail chain so that's it that's basically how to use it on your smartphone and to build both your whatsapp contact list and your email list for marketing just because i have any question or clarification please don't forget to leave a question or your clarification I'll be glad to answer your questions. Thank you.